Hello, my name is Owen. And I'm Nathan. And we are both on the Build and Electrical team for the 20182 Lunatex. Today we're going to give a, a brief tutorial on wire management uh, systems for extending parts of monitor into the deep robot. For this year's challenge, we chose a variety of different methods for extending parts. The first and simplest method we use is coiled wire. We use this on our shorter travel extensions. Uh, the upsides are that it's very cost effective, very easy to create. The downsides is the wires could deform and need to be reformed. So this is our coiled wire. We make it by first wrapping the wire around wire wrap and then wrapping that around a pole. You can make it as loose as tight as you need depending on what wire you're retracting. So after we wrap it up, we first hit it with the heat gun and then we let it cool and that's what gives it the coiled shape. Our second method is drag chain. We normally choose this method for shorter vertical extending parts. The plus side for this method is the cables are protected with an armored covering. The downside is there must be ample room for the chain to fall without getting obstructed. Our third method of wire management is the scissor method. This method is for horizontal, bigger horizontal extenders. This year we chose to make ours from Go Build a Flat Beams and some poly bushings. This method can also be produced with craft sticks, washers, and screws. This provides a budget-friendly alternative for the scissor method. This is our fourth and final method for wire management. This is our constant tension spool, our CTS for short. Me and Owen developed it together earlier this year. For this method, we use retractable badge holders attached to a shaft holding two wire spools. The cable from the badge holder provides both tension and retraction for our wires. We found that we needed a small amount of tension to both ends of our wires to aid in the spooling action. To accomplish this, we simply added some anchored springs on both ends. Since the wire itself is always under a small amount of tension, we were sure to add servo clips on our connections and tension relief loops on high stress areas. We hope this short tutorial helped any team struggling with wire management. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below or contact us through our website, lunatex1.github.io. Thank you.